Hello Lilas, welcome back to my channel guys. If you're new to this channel and you have not met Vegas, this is Vegas. Um, if you have not subscribed, take the time, hit the subscribe button, it's just a click. And then click the bell so that you can be a part of all the notifications. Give this video a thumbs up, leave me a comment. All that is very important. Share, share, share. If you got a group on Facebook, share. If you're on Instagram, tell people to come follow me. Um, on Instagram it's Mr. Randy Smith Babies. Um, I have a blog. If you guys have not been following my blog, I've started back blogging. It's Mr. Randy Smith Babies .com. Um, and I have a pay channel membership, which is two tiers now. I have a dollar and ninety nine tier for exclusive videos and updates. Second tier is uh, for live streams. Um, exclusive live streams and updates and videos um a lot of people and i i have to i keep telling people this so that no one gets you know misinformed i do i am planning on doing some paint and chats in there um i do not do tutorials i do not share how i paint i do not share my colors i do not share what i use blah 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 blah, blah. i just paint and talk um in some of it videos i've only done one baby in there so far i started on another baby but i haven't finished that baby i had to pause on that baby so i will be doing it and it's only reborns so i will never paint silicone on video i don't think never say never i don't think um but anyway vegas 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 oh my gosh um i don't know what happened it is the weirdest thing. I was I tried to make a video before and I had to redo it. Um, but it's the weirdest thing that I am like it's like all of a sudden I'm just more bonded to Vegas than ever before. And it was only after I was painting Zenday and I finished Zenday that I felt more connected to Vegas. It's so weird. Like, what does one have to do with the other? I don't know. It's got to be something psychological going there. And as you know, hey, I don't know. I have to think. I have to really think about why. Um, maybe. Oh gosh. See, I'm about to ruin the video again. Anyway, so I'm gonna. I don't really like to put him in clothes. So, um, too much. I like just looking at him like this. But I am going to put him on a blue side snap just because it is it is getting cold here. I don't know, baby. This might not work. Oh, I think I think Bryson actually wore this because <laughs> it, it has a, a milk stain on it. Yep, he did wear this. Oh, goodness. Yep, Bryson wore this. Oh well, guys, don't don't judge me, but this is it has it does have a milk stain on it, on the sleeve. You know how you put the cuffs over the baby hand. Apparently, we did that, and he wiped his mouth or something on it. I don't know. All right. So I'm probably going to block the light a little bit so I don't need nobody yelling going, oh, I couldn't even see him. Because, you know, people love to be the, the, the film directors. <laughs> oh, my gosh, you're wearing Bryson's little milky shirt. <laughs> it was actually my baby's and I think I let Bryson wear it. Oh, my gosh. This is why you can't let those real kids wear your baby's clothes. OMG. This is exactly why. This is exactly why people say, why spend all that money on doll clothes? Why would you spend that much on an outfit for a doll clothes? You could spend that on a real baby. The reason why you don't spend it on a real baby, because they throw up, they poop, they stain the clothes, they outgrow them. And so you don't really get your money's worth. When you have dolls, they don't poop, they don't throw up. And they don't grow. So, the outfit that you spend $30 on for a doll will last a lifetime versus 
two weeks on a newborn because newborns grow so fast it's over before you know it so that's why it makes more sense to spend money on a doll I would spend more money on my doll clothes than I would ever spend on my real children when they were this age now as they get older that's different but as at this stage absolutely not I would I would not spend my money on my babies like this I would spend money on other things for them but not not clothes because they outgrow those clothes so quick they don't get to wear them but maybe once you're lucky if they get to wear them three times um they're they're really really growing like wildflower at this at this age and stage so yeah but anyway this uh little hat and the socks came from um angela plucker actually she sent it to me um it was a gift so that was really sweet so i will always have this in my collection um and it was during while i was purchasing um a lot of different stuff i purchased a lot of hair from her and different stuff rooting needles and all that kind of stuff and just reborn in supplies um that she was selling so anyway so she sent me these and it was really nice and a scarf he is a, it's a scarf that goes to it but yeah so that is vegas i hope you guys liked seeing vegas um get oh look at vegas i gotta uh figure out how to root eyebrows again like that because i actually really really he's my he has my favorite eyebrows and they really are rooted just like um they're rooted just like like how ours grow in and i me and my kiddos have very much um we have um very thick eyebrows um that's another reason why i absolutely love the willow sculpt too because they they truly <laughs> remind me of my my kids um the awake version a lot of people like oh they've got too much space in between their eyes and stuff well that's how my real children were so it is what it is um so it's funny so real quick that's that's a whole nother thing like a lot of people you know and including myself be like i don't know why she think that baby all that that scope is the worst but you never know like it might remind them of a kid or a family member or themselves and you know i don't know we 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 do too much in this community <laughs> we really do at times because i promise you sometimes you're like oh that baby look like a whole you know this or that and uh, and then somebody come out and be like i bought this baby because i think it looks so much like me and you like uh, oops <laughs> sorry boo <laughs> but you know also though something can look like somebody or you know a baby can look like somebody and they could truly look like them but not be as cute as the actual person or as cute as the real baby like you can do a portrait and the portrait can look like the baby but not be as cute and flattering um as a sculpture but as but the baby can be cute it's just you know or vice versa the sculpture can be cute and the baby could be not so cute you know what i mean like it's it's you know it's just we just have preferences and do you know that everybody thinks i should separate this somewhere well i don't know i think everybody think they're pretty or they think they're cute well some people have low self-esteem and that's a different issue but on an average most people think they are actually cute or pretty but there's somebody in the world that will disagree <laughs> with all of us so beauty is in the eye of the beholder it's gotta be true anyway guys with all that, I just say, love you. Love being who you are. Collect what you love. 
and enjoy it. Yes, baby.